Hey, what's up? It's Razor here from Razor Media, and today I'll be showing you guys how to make amazing 3DS badges such as these ones that you see up here for organization. And without any further ado, let's begin. Now, if you don't want to make your own custom badges, but you do like the ones that you saw me use on my 3DS, there will be a download link in the description. However, if you're here wanting to learn how to make your own custom badges, there are going to be a few prerequisites. First of which, you're going to have to at least have some basic Photoshop knowledge. And don't worry, I'll be providing some templates for everyone to work with. But I use Photoshop because it allows me to create the specific 64 by 64 or 128 by 64 images that I need to create an image for the uh, badge maker to import and use as a badge on your 3DS. Also a prerequisite, as you have heard me mention before, there is a custom badge maker, it's called a GYTB and basically what it is, it's a homebrew software that allows you to import PNG images formatted at 64 by 64, uh, that's the resolution and you use the software to basically import them and it the, the 3DS sees it as a legitimate badge. There will also be a link in the description for the uh, GitHub page where you can download that software. Now the UI of the software is pretty simple. You only press one button but we'll get to that later. Now what you want to do first is know what you're going to create as a badge and then you grab my template which again link in the description and you can either download or create whatever you want to be the badge. Here we're going to use this Zelda PNG image and we're going to use this to create our first badge and well from here it's pretty simple all you have to do is drag and drop this from from uh, wherever you download it to the Photoshop template size it accordingly of course because a lot of them is going to be way too big for the uh, for the template but once you made it fit in the template all you have to do is uh, save as PNG or export as PNG then find some way to copy it to your 3DS whether that be through removing your SD card and sticking it into your computer or via FTP and FTP here is my preferred method as you can do all of this without removing your SD card or turning the system off but once you're ready to copy them over all you have to do is create a uh, folder on your uh, memory cards root called badges and that's where you copy all of your properly formatted uh, PNG images to. Now once they're all there all you have to do is open the badge maker and press that one button and wait for it to load once it done once it's finished loading go back to the home screen and you should be able to see all your badges that you've now created and there we go guys in quick and simple steps how to create custom badges using a, using the uh, GYTD homebrew on your 3DS. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, give it a uh, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.